Hey guys, what's up? Um, I want to show you what you get when you get the fire stick and the fire box, how to use it. The video is going to be kind of long, but it really answers a lot of questions. Um, so if you have the time to watch it, you really should. Um, when you first load the Amazon stick or box, depending on what you got, what you'll want to do is uh, you'll want to go all the way to the bottom. It'll say settings and then you'll go to the right and it'll say uh, networks and then you'll want to find your Wi-Fi network, put in your password, log in. Once you get that done, you're going to want to push the little home button. It looks like a house on the remote twice. You push it one, two, and it'll open this right here. And you'll come into here and you'll see this. You'll see movies, TV shows, live TV, yada, yada. So movies, uh, a real popular program was Genesis. The developer stopped developing on it because of the volume of users for the free server. He is building a new one that'll be really nice as well. And when that's up and running, I'll make a video to show you how to install it. But for now, what you got is a few other options. When you press OK on the movie button, it'll bring you here. This is Stream All the Sources. Pretty popular. Um, I added a premium server to this, and I'll show you about that right now. Not many categories. I mean, if you know what movie you want to look for, you can search it. Otherwise, you can go to popular, but I would usually just stick with trending movies. You click that, and it'll be the most, you know, recently watched movies by people, you know, that it logs. Uh, like The Revenant, The Last Witch Hunter. Let's click it. When you click this, a bar is going to come up. It's going to load all the sources. So just let it do its thing. It takes about 20 or 30 seconds. When this is done, you'll see a blue writing on the top right of the screen. And it's just finishing loading everything up so we can watch it. There it is right there. So then you're going to get this list that's going to come up. Now, these green ones, you want to look for the green ones. Those are the premium server. That's the premium server that I have and I added to this. Obviously, you want to look for HD, 720, 1080p. Um, but high works really good. If you go to this, it says, you know, like this says low. And that means low quality, medium quality, high quality. Um, I don't know if you can really see it, but it's on the left-hand side right there. Um, so, obviously, you want to look for the ones that say HD, 720. We'll go ahead and click. You let it load and then the movie will load up. Uh, we'll just start from the beginning. If you press up once, fast forward is 10 minutes. So there you go. There's the last wish hunter. And there's a ton of movies here you can go through and look, you know, look for. Um, Force Awakens, I don't know how good that is. Let's give it a shot and see if it's on here. And then I want to show you a couple other movie programs because there's a ton of movies on here, but um, there's two other movie programs that I put on there specifically. There's about five total, but I'm just going to go over two more and show you how to use them. Um, and after you get familiar with the device, you start exploring all you want. You're not going to mess anything up at all, um, so don't worry about that. So once you get comfortable enough, start just exploring, and you know maybe you'll find a program you like better than that. So here's Star Wars The Force Awakens. Uh, we'll go ahead and try this one. It says hi. Remember, use the green ones first if you can. See, like, that one's not going to work. Um, and I forgot to tell you, on the right side of the servers, it'll say a number out of 100. It'll say, like, 99 slash 100. If you see a high number, let me, let me let it load so I can show you. If you see a high number like 99 slash 100, don't do that one because there's already 99 people on the 100 server yeah so now I'm, let's see what's going on okay so let's see see like this one right here says 13 out of 100 right here so 13 out of 100 that's the one you want to use if you see like i said 99 or 100 out of 100 don't even try to go to it because you're going to get kicked out and it's not going to let you in so this one says 13 and it's a, a premium server link so just kind of keep mindful of that when you're on salts now obviously this is in the theaters and it's a really Coveted movie, but whoa, quality's really high. I mean, quality is actually really good, but the volume was high. Um, you know, it's definitely watchable, as you guys can see. So, if you haven't seen it, you can watch it, or if you have seen it and you want to watch it again, you Star Force Awakens. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, there's a ton of good movies on here and old movies. They're just not categorized that great. So, I mean, you'll just have to go through and start looking for them, you know. 
if you get out of this by pressing the back arrow, the back arrow, um, and you press down here, you're going to have some more options here. Now, Phoenix is a good one as well, and this one's a little more categorized. So when you open Phoenix, you're going to get this. It's going to come to here. You're going to see Woody, and that's a TV thing. Um, but this one right here, Stale, I don't know how to say it, 2014, click it. That's the movie link. Why they named it that, I have no idea. Um, there's 2016, 15. There's a little more collection here, you know, kids and animation. Um, but there's more movies here, and they are HD quality. Um, the other thing that Phoenix has that that other stream doesn't is that screeners. Um, people get DVDs to go ahead and watch uh, a movie for awards. You know, they're called screeners. So when you see this, you know it's a DVD quality off the bat. You just pick one of these links. We'll resume. Obviously, I started testing it earlier. I was supposed to be magazine's man of the year. Then Dan Cockney was born. So this is Jobs. The new Steve Jobs movie. Thanks, you too. It's a big morning. Yeah. So you'll know. I don't know if you can see on the camera, but it's DVD quality. It's 720, and it's it's really good. You know, so <clears throat> that's a good thing about this program, Phoenix. So all these will be screeners. You know, Legend, uh, the notorious true story of that gangster. Uh, let's give it a shot. Oh, go to resume again. Obviously, I was testing all these to make sure they work. So. Whoa, whoa, watch the language. Anyway, so the screeners for sure are going to be great quality. So if you haven't seen any of these movies or you have and you want to watch it again, it's just like having the DVD at your house. Um, obviously, there's some more HD movies. You just have to go through and look for them. You know, I don't know, The Martian. Uh, let's check this one out. You click one of the links. Some, oh my goodness. Um, sometimes you'll click a link and it won't work. And then just, you just, the link's down, you know, and there's nothing you can do about it, but... So you can see, I mean, there's some really good movies here for you to watch in really good quality. It's just not as convenient as it used to be. I mean, you got to go to different programs now, but this is, you know, this is, these are the movies and you can go ahead and look and you can search. Obviously, you can go ahead and go into search uh, when you're in there. There's also kids. Let's go to kids and animation. So, you know, if kids want to watch something, Hotel Transylvania 2. So we'll resume, like always. Fish? Oh, oh. it's babies! You gotta answer it. You're pushing too hard. Sorry about that, it's loud. Uh, so I just want to show you that these movies are working. Um, and, you know, there's no issues. The good dinosaur. <laughs> um, it'll, it'll work as well. Just give it a few seconds to load up. And then you have the good dinosaur on. Uh, sometimes this happens and what happens is it starts to play in the the background and it doesn't load on the main screen you just click it again and it'll if you just it didn't load again but okay so that's the thing sometimes it doesn't work right off the first bat oops there it goes I was rushing in it too much but there you go there's a good dinosaur sorry about that guys oops fast forward on that but I don't want to ruin this movie for anyone. So, yeah, there's more stuff for the kids. You know, all these movies are in there and they all work great. Frozen Fever, obviously. Um, so that's Phoenix, okay? So that's Salts and Phoenix. Now, if you just click movies, you go straight into stream all the sources. If you press down, you can pick Phoenix. There's also Navi X. Um, that one I'm not going to get into right this moment. I'll make a separate video because it's very long and just a ton of adult content you have to filter through and stuff like that. So... As for the TV shows, same concept. You press OK. It's going to take you to a program called One Channel, and you can go to search. You can go through A through Z. You can go to most popular. And uh, I usually just hit most popular when I'm trying to find a new show to watch, or you want to watch The Big Bang. We'll click here. We'll go season nine. We'll pick an episode. We'll let it load. <clears throat> when you come through One Channel like this, the TV shows like this. Um, it'll say on the left DVD, you know, obviously just pick one that has a lot of views because obviously a lot of people are watching it's working fine and you'll get the hang of it. Like I said, I can't explain everything in the video. It's boring and confusing. Fast forward and just make sure everything's working. What surprises? <sighs> we don't want to spoil anything, but you should know that Sheldon said he's ready to be physical. You shut your damn mouth! <laughs> 
I love that show. Um, anyway, so <laughs> anyway, so that's TV shows. Um, you can go through any of them. Like I said, you can search for a TV show if you're looking for one, you know, and uh, you'll find all of them there. Every season, every episode is here. You know, even older shows like Friends. Um, you can go search advanced search description you don't want to do all that just in case you don't know the show or you can type the name of the show right here or you can just go a through z genres yada yada uh it's real simple you guys will get the hang of it if you have any questions you can just ask me live tv um there's an issue with live tv right now and the sports hd um live tv there's channels on here you can watch um i would recommend c cloud tv um you guys can just explore it when you click it it says <clears throat> live tv you can go to news, you can go to all channels. I mean, if you want to watch some TV that you don't have, maybe you don't have cable, or maybe it's going to go in the room and you don't have a cable box, you can watch some news. Oops. Away a hard charging Stuff like that, okay? But you guys explore through there and see what you want to watch. Um, sports, Sports HD, where you're going to watch all the games, football, baseball, soccer, UFC pay-per-views, all in HD streaming. It's down right now until Saturday. Um, Yours is going to look like this, so don't click it until um, I send a text because then I'll give you my login uh, info and my password, and you can log right in. But it's down right now, so if you try it, it's just going to look like this, and it's going to have nothing for you to watch, you know? Um, so I will sh explain that to you, but if you really want to watch sports right now, just hit sports and sports devil, and you go to live sports. You can pick one of these servers. I always use first row sports GE. Um, but there's some, all these servers work just fine and they all have different things. Um, you can go to ESPN. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see if we can get sports that working. And there you go, there's ESPN. Well, David, it was, it was kind of bittersweet for me. I mean, I was drafted by the Los Angeles Rams in So, I mean, that's live TV. I mean, that's sports that will. So if you want to watch, like I said, oops, sports, um, you can go through here and you can watch the games and everything. But I, it'll be up by this weekend, so you can watch all the sports in HD, HD <clears throat> TV. But um, I wish I could show you this. I'll make a separate video to show you how to work the sports HD. Um, and that's about it. Um, every once in a while, you can come over here to system. If you press down, it'll give you these options. Um, this is how you turn off the program. You press quit. But every once in a while you see this thing that says thumbnails cleaner, just click it. Because when you're looking through all those movies and stuff, um, it saves all the pictures and all this. It just starts to clutter up the space. What you want to do is click it. You want to go over here to where it says clean. Press clean. Another screen will come up after it loads all this stuff. You just go over to the left once where it says proceed. You click it and it'll start cleaning out all the stuff you don't need. Um, just to give you a little more space, you know what I mean? Because you don't have to do it every day, but you know, every other day you should do it at least once just to keep it running smooth because you start to build cash and all this stuff and sometimes it kind of gets annoying. But if you forget and you start to see that, that something's like starting to be slow, just remember to come do the thumbnail cleaner to help you out. Um, but other than that, that, I mean, that's everything. Like I said, once the sports HD is back online, uh, I'll make a video to show you how to use it, but it's really easy as well. If you have any questions, like I said, you can... You can comment on the YouTube page or you can text me if you got the number or my wife if you get one through my wife. Um, that way I can I can help, okay? So uh, let's see what we got here and then uh, I just, thanks for watching, alright guys? 70 megabytes saved. Alright, talk to you guys soon.